Welcome to Smoky CNC Woodworks. The last few weeks I've been doing stuff that was graphics, you know, graphic design stuff. This week is still a graphic design, but this one actually has more purpose. This is going to be a wedding gift for a young couple that's getting married here in a week or two. And it's something my wife requested, so this was an important one. So let's go.
that was it. I thought it came out awesome. This couple, the, the boy is a, the boy, the young man is, he cowboys for a living. And the young lady also is from the country. So we figured the rope around it would be a nice touch. This is just a piece of rope. I pieced all this one together. Uh, found the rope on one location. Found the little scroll there in another. And the rest is just a font that's off my program. Oh, need to get a rag. Had to take a little hiatus there. If you saw, I had some uh, stain running out of some of the lettering. It takes a while for it to dry up in there. And it doesn't hurt anything on the black. If you're doing a lighter color, you want to watch staining it because, you know, it gets down in a white or a yellow. It'll really mess it up, make it look nasty. So on a sign like this where I've stained it, I'll, uh, I'll let it set overnight and I'll come back in tomorrow and put a pretty decent coat of polyurethane on it. Well, the first coat's going to be lighter. Then I'll sand it, put the second coat on. That way it makes it really shine and glisten. And I usually do that on this kind of stuff. Anything that I put stain on, that way you don't get stain all over everything because it will seep out just a little bit here and there. So kind of changing gears here. If you'll remember here a while back, I talked about, we we're thinking about selling our house. Well, we listed it. It's got a contract. It looks like it's actually going to sell. So I'm hoping I can get enough videos built up so you won't notice the gap in uh, <laughs> where we're homeless. Because <laughs> we're still looking. We haven't found where we're going yet. Uh, you know, so there's always hurdles with this kind of thing. My biggest hurdle is finding a shop that's big enough to hold everything I've got. And, you know, moving the CNC machine is going to be a nightmare. That thing's going to be heavy. Anyway, just giving you a heads up. So guys, that's going to be it for today. If y'all haven't done so yet, please subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time.